Hi dear students, let's see this question that came in KVPY 2018 essay part 1 physics paper. The question is simple again based on the formula i equals to nqabd. So basically there were two questions in this paper which were uh, based on this formula. So what's happening over here basically there is a steady current i which is set up in a wire whose cross sectional area decreases that means we have this sort of situation okay and current i is flowing in this direction. So we have to uh, choose the correct options according to the data. Okay. So let me draw the situation here itself. So the current density decreases in the value. Now we know that that current density is current per unit area. That means I by A. So if area is decreasing, so current density will increase, not decrease. So A is, uh, option A is wrong. Magnitude of electric field increases. Now, if you know the microscopic form of Ohm's law, it says that current density J is equals to sigma into E, which means uh, current density at any point will be equals to sigma times electric field. Now, as we realize that if we move in the forward direction, current density is increasing. Sigma is a property of material, so sigma will be constant. It's, it represents the conductivity of the material, so it, it will be constant. Hence, if J is increasing, so electric field will increase. If we move in the forward direction so option b is right current density remains constant is wrong the average speed of the moving charge what, what is the average speed that is nothing but i equals to we can find that by n e a b n q a b d so n is constant because that represents number of charge particles per unit volume again a property of the material i is given constant q is charge on one particle will be constant so if a is decreasing so v dish will increase and hence option D will also be wrong. So only option B is correct. I hope you would have understood a fairly simple question. That's it. Thank you.